Queensland now has the largest number of pleasure boats per capita in the entire country. To the point where last year, the local boating community hit the magic 200,000 registered boat marks. I'm proud to say a large chunk of those were built right here in South East Queensland. And practising what they preach today at Day's Gutter on Morton Island are two of the most experienced families in the Queensland marine industry that are the driving force behind two of its most respected brands, the Haynes Group and Springwood Marine. Springwood Marine has always set out to achieve a boating experience for people. It's not about, it's not about owning a boat, it's about a lifestyle, which we try, we encourage people to, to not just when they buy a boat, that's the beginning for us. Now it's important to me to have the family in the business. I have my, both my son and my daughter. Um, Amanda and Michael work with me in the business and it's great that they've grown up on the water. John Jr and his brother Greg first started working on the factory floor of the family boat business almost 30 years ago. And it's safe to say that it's in very good hands for at least the next 30. My father started uh, his original business in 1959, uh, which would make it 50 years old this year. Uh, and we started the signature business in 1984, which has become the Haynes Group and, and encompassed the signature Seafarer, uh, Haynes Traveller, Suzuki, Nautique and Walker Bay. I'm terribly proud of what, what my father created and it's, it's very important to me that I continue to, to um, protect that legacy and, and ensure that um, I not only protect the legacy that he's left, he's left Greg and, and myself and, and my, my two daughters, uh, but also to protect, um, to, to build on the legacy that he's, he's left us. A quick bite to eat, a swim and a catch up is on the agenda before an afternoon of fishing. I know how important boating is to you and how important the company and your lineage, I suppose, because it's more than a job really what you're doing, isn't it? I love what I do, Dan. I mean, I go out in boats every weekend, it's, it's just, it's a passion for me. Yeah. So this is your boat of choice to go fishing today up against the Brenchleys, you and your brother? Well, Dino, it's a 675 signature. It's um, our premium fishing boat. And, um, like, you know, we fished this boat at 1770 last year. Yeah. And it's, uh, it's a great boat for inshore, offshore fishing. We'll be fishing whiting today. How do you think you boys will go? Uh, I think we should do all right. I mean, this is our backyard, so we yeah. should do pretty good. You know your way around the bay, all right, that's for yeah, sure. Yeah, exactly. While the Haynes boys have gone with the leader in the signature range, the Brenchleys have gone with the 600F. Why did you and Gary pick this? Well, it's just the perfect sort of thing for Morton Bay. I mean, it's a, it's a designated fishing boat. I mean, it's got a massive cockpit. There's plenty of room. Um, it's got all the rod holders everywhere, all the electronics. It's just great. So, mate, I was going to say, what's it like working for Dad? Or should I say, what's it like working with Dad? Mate, I think when you grow up as a kid, you know, your father's always your hero. Yeah. And I've always wanted to follow his footsteps. And now I can combine working with my father, or for him, depends which way you look at it, and my love of boats. I mean, it's just perfect. So before too much water starts to move, we need to get ourselves out into the bay. We're going to cut to a quick commercial break before we return to see if these guys can also walk the walk. to Creature Coast on this Saturday afternoon. I said before the break we'd go fishing and a promise given is a promise delivered. You've seen both of these families, you know these fellas get on fantastically well, but when it comes to fishing, all is fair in love and war. The competitive juices start to flow and I reckon there's a very good chance that that's going to happen this afternoon. I'm with John Jr and Greg on board the signature 675F and the Brenchley boys, Gary and son Michael, are on the signature 600RF. We're targeting Whiting in the Rouse Channel, just on the southern tip of Morton Island and I reckon we'll get a few today, so let's get into it. So what happens when you mix business with pleasure? Well, plenty of whiting, oh, little ribbing and plenty of boat talk. I, I guess it's good to make the point that, you know, you blokes, you use your product. You, this is something that you do when you're not at work, isn't I, it? I love boating. That's... Oh, here we go. Uh, it's one of the things I do every weekend. It's, it's... I get out in the water. If it's not fishing, just a group of friends go out and just... Yeah, you can't see Wrenchley's eyes, but I can see that he's looking across. Oh, oh. Man, he dropped it. <laughs> oh, well. I think he's got the gaff and he's <laughs> pulling on your line on the boat or something. He's a monster. 
Touch on a milestone reached by the company this year. 25 years, yeah. It started that this company that started in uh, 1984. So yeah. uh, we anniversary with silver anniversary. Uh, we're going to do a few special edition models uh, to mark the, the, the occasion. And of course, from fairly humble beginnings too, but you look at what's going on now, you've got a range of uh, boats that you manufacture and produce and of course uh, work very closely with Suzuki and work very closely with these blokes over here at Springwood. Absolutely. We've just got to make sure we outfish them today. <laughs> exactly. The Haynes boys have landed a few fish already and the Brenchley's boat isn't doing too badly either. Hey! Tell you what, I'm having much more success over here on the Brenchley boat than I was on the on the Haynes boat. What's Springwood Marine's position in the in the marketplace? The Springwood Marine would be, without a doubt, one of the biggest dealers in in Queensland for for all brands, and it's been very much a family business for 30 years. This is what these guys call R&D. That's research and development. Not bad, hey. And I tell you what, it's a pretty nice life, isn't it? Just it is a good life. It Very is nice good. lifestyle. Everyone should be doing it. Just like this. Out here on a beautiful day in the Rouse Channel, catching whitey, having a nice cold drink and kicking back like this bloke. Your companionship. It's not competitive at all, though, is it? No, it's not competitive at all, um, Dean. Not at all. Can you just cut their boat loose, Michael? <laughs> the Haynes Group are designing boats for boaties. And Springwood Marine has the team and the hands-on experience to guide you into the boating lifestyle, which is what makes these guys such a good combination. Spend some time on the Haynes Group website and look over their range of boats. Then get yourself into Springwood Marine's Open Day next weekend and talk to the team about your needs. Now, it doesn't really matter. It's no big deal. It'll never be discussed again. But the moment of truth has arrived. It's time to do a count on how many whiting were caught by each team today, each family. How many have we got here? Team Brenchley, 12. Team Brenchley, 12. Reasonably nice-sized winter whiting. And the Haynes boys... 13. 13, they're telling me. I demand a recount. We want to, we want to see them. Where are they? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a bit like I'm from the factory and I'm here to help you? <laughs>